Bhagavad Gita, text 2.66 Unless one is disciplined in yoga, one cannot have clear intelligence. Unless one is so disciplined, one cannot engage in meditation. Without meditation, there is no peace. And how can one have happiness without peace? As we have seen in verse 61 of this chapter, here Krishna is again speaking of fixing the mind on himself. Those whose senses are uncontrolled cannot have knowledge and thus they cannot fix their mind and intelligence on Krishna. Such persons cannot have peace, and without peace of mind there is no question of real happiness. People think happiness comes from sense indulgence, but it is not true. Happiness can only come after controlling the senses. When the senses are controlled, the mind becomes pure, and then one can think of God with steady intelligence and engage in meditation. Only by such meditation and devotion can one attain enlightened life and real happiness. Krishna next illustrates his point by citing an example. He wants to demonstrate how failure to concentrate one's mind on him results in spiritual disaster. <laughs> 